G'day hot sauce lovers. Well, it's product review time again, and today I'm going to be reviewing this product right here. Frank's Red Hot Original Cayenne Pepper Sauce. Now you've probably seen this advertised quite a lot lately on the TV, you know, it's got that alien saying, can you put it on humans? <laughs> Pretty good ad that one. Anyway, what I want to do is try this red hot sauce and well, see how hot it is and maybe put it on a few things and well, compare it to Tabasco and see what the heat difference is as well. Well, it's got some spiel on it, so let's have a read of what that says. Frank's Red Hot Original, made with a premium blend of aged cayenne peppers, has been adding flavour to your favourite foods for over 90 years. The great taste of Frank's Red Hot made it the secret ingredient used in the original buffalo wings created in Buffalo, New York in 1964. Yeehaw! Now you probably know that it's got the saying, I put that bleh on everything. Blur being that swear word which you can't even say on YouTube anymore. Ah, that. But how about we check out its ingredients, see what it's actually made out of. Okay. Ingredients: aged cayenne red peppers, 36%, distilled vinegar, water, salt, and garlic powder. Wow, it's got like hardly any ingredients in there at all. It's got some nutritional values, only just though. Mainly it's got like well, not much of anything. <laughs> so it's pretty pointless me trying to read that out because there's nothing really to read. Anyway, how about we crack it open and start giving it a try? Ah, I love to crack the seal. That was easy. Now I have got some Tabasco sauce here so I can compare it with that. Now, the heat in this is only supposed to be 450 on the Scoville scale, which is a heat index, whereas Tabasco's heat index is 2500. So this is approximately five times hotter than this. Well, let's find out. I don't want to taint my taste buds with Tabasco yet. So let's pour some on my shovel. Oh, it's a lot thicker than I thought it would be. That's what she said. It's got a nice sort of thickness there, although it is still runny. Woo! Oh, yeah! Mmm! Yeah, that's got a nice taste. Wow, that one's good. It's got a bit of heat there, and it's sort of a little bit of sweetness to it. It's, it's a really nice balance. It's, it's not too vinegary, because vinegar is a major thing in there, but, mate, Seriously, that is a really nice tasting sauce. I could imagine myself putting that on everything. Let's compare it to the Tabasco. Well, gee. You can see how much more watery that Tabasco sauce is. Now, I do love my Tabasco, so we'll see. Oh! Ah. Yeah, I mean, I do like it. Is it hotter, though? Well, straight off the bat, I thought... No, it's not even as hot, or it's about the same, but as that Tabasco makes its way down, yeah, it is, um, it is quite a bit hotter. And you can, it sort of tastes a little bit more vinegary as well. Now, the difference between these is Tabasco is made from the Tabasco peppers, and Frank's Red Hot is made from cayenne peppers. And cayenne peppers are much better in general to be used on buffalo wings. Also better for soups, stews, marinades, and sauces as well. And another interesting fact about hot sauces is that they have shown to have antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and anti-cancer effects in labs. Oh. Anyway, they claim that this is good on everything, so how about we try some on some things? Alright, well, I've got some chips here. Let's see what it tastes like on some chips. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tastes good on that. How about some pizza? Alright. Yeah. Put some more on there. Okay. Come at me. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. It tastes especially good when you mix it with some cheesy creaminess. Which reminds me. I wonder what it's like on a piece of plastic cheese. Love sauce on cheese. 
Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, that's good. What about a piece of toast with some butter? Yeah, I see. Mmm, that makes a great sandwich. But how will it go on something a little bit more unusual like some spinach? Make a boat. <laughs> Can confirm. It even tastes good on spinach. Well, there you go, Frank's Red Hot Sauce. Does it taste good on everything? Well, yes, it does. It's really nice. The sauce is quite a lot thicker and it's got a, just a nicer sort of flavour. But do I prefer it to Tabasco? Yes, I do actually. This Frank's Red Hot is a really nice sauce and it's definitely one that I would keep in my pantry or in the fridge after opening it. Do you like Frank's Red Hot sauce? Tell me, what do you like to put yours on? Let me know down below. Will you be heading out to buy some? If you're going through the checkout, tell them Greg sent you. <laughs> They won't have a clue. Rightio, -hey, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. I'll review something. See you then. Oh yeah, this is Greg's Kitchen where the review